so you guys so i want to bring y'all this video on liangelo ball and also miss nikki baby just because we got a lot of things that we have to talk about so check this out we all know just recently jello has announced to the world on instagram that him and nikki are expecting a child together he posted multiple pictures of them together while holding her stomach and they also collab with the people magazine as well by taking exclusive photos when you read the caption under jello's post he included by saying big thank you to our people for giving us this platform to share this wonderful news with the world my partner and i are excited for this next chapter of our journey as soon to be parents nikki also posted the same thing including having the same caption as well so when you read the article that the people magazine made about lianslo and nikki expecting a child together it seems like their child will be born throughout this summer and also if you guys are not informed Lianzlo is currently 24 years old while Nikki is currently 32 years old so they are about eight years apart in age and for their backgrounds Nikki is a former TV star being on Love and Hip Hop Hollywood while Jello is currently a professional basketball player right now he's a free agent after signing a one-year non-guaranteed contract with the Charlotte Hornets during the beginning of the season including playing in the G League with the Greensboro Swarm as well so when you read the people magazine article nikki spoke out by saying we're both so excited about becoming parents we spoke about having a life and kids when we first met our goals dreams the life we wanted and then it really happened she also included by saying we can't wait to meet our baby and begin this new chapter together it's super exciting for us both being first-time parents and getting to experience everything together so here's the thing you guys for liangelo he claims that he was in charlotte when he first heard the news about nikki being pregnant and he also wanted to wait to tell others in person when he returned home to california so that's why everybody is now receiving the news about nikki's pregnancy jello also told the people's magazine by saying when i told my mom and pops they were shocked a little bit but i think more so excited than anything my mom was yelling and cheering in excitement when I told my brothers who are Melo and Lonzo, they were happy for me and also excited to become new uncles to my seed. And we all know Lonzo, who is Liangelo's older brother, already has a child whose name is Zoe with his baby mother Denise, but he's currently dating Ali Roselle. And for Melo, he is currently with Anna, but does not have a child. So congratulations to Liangelo for expecting his first child with Nikki. And honestly, the thing about their relationship when you rewind back to September the 26th last year, the reason on how everybody found out that Jello and Nikki were even together is because during that day, she ended up making multiple posts about Jello. The first post she made, Jello gave her flowers and roses. Then after that, Nikki started to shout him out multiple times, explaining on how much she liked him. Then she later made another post of her and Jello actually making out. So that's when everybody knew that they were officially together. And I honestly would not be surprised if she ended up getting pregnant that day as well. Because that was about seven months ago. And when you look at Nikki's stomach, it looked like she's been pregnant for about seven months. And to remind y'all, Nikki was throwing shade at Jello's exes as well, including other females that want him. So if you guys want me to make another video talking about Liangelo Ball's exes, just let me know in the comments. Because I have a lot of information, such as speaking with Jello myself a few times. We had a few conversations on Instagram about his relationship with Jaden Owens. We all know around that time when Jello was dealing with Jaden, they had a lot of problems going on. So I was just trying to help Jello. And you know, we were just talking back and forth about some things. You guys should go check out my previous videos when I was talking about him and Jaden Owens' relationship. I can even show y'all a few messages that I had with Jello in the past when we were just talking about females in life in general. And I remember when Jello responded to me and said, yeah, bro, I done dealt with some crazy females in my life, cuz, but it is what it is, LOL. And I responded to him and said, I feel that, bro. So are you and Jaden good now? And he responded back to me and said, oh, me and Jaden are friends, but we are not together right now. We just was arguing and stuff about life, but I respect her. No one cheated. We just had different views and s on stuff. So we was really talking about a lot of deep stuff around that time because I had my own problems as well. And me and Jello was just relating to a lot of things. So of course him and Jaden ended up falling off. Then right after that relationship, he started dating Ebony. Him and Ebony ended up falling off in about a year. So Jello was going through some things with females, of course. And now that he's with Miss Nikki Baby, they're having a child together. So hopefully everything will work out with them. And I just wish them the best because I seen what Jello been through even when he was at high school dealing with Izzy. 
So he actually been through a lot for real. And on top of that, his situation on the court, he's still trying to find his way in a league. Right now, he possibly might go overseas and play in the NBL so he can possibly get back in a league and have a certified spot. And on top of that, he's still trying to find his own way in the basketball world. But good thing he has a good support system such as his family, including Nikki's family as well. So once the baby come, they'll have support and it won't be too much stress on him because Jello still has to stay focused. He's been going through the same thing ever since he was in college and he is still trying to find his way in the league. So he still definitely has to make it to the end goal on where his brothers are at. And honestly, the thing about Leangelo and Nikki, it seems like they really are rocking with each other because when you look at a few comments under her post, you'll see Jello say my fave person and he will also leave black hearts with multiple emojis in her comments as well. And even just recently when Nikki announced to everybody about her pregnancy, Jello left a comment and said, yeah, love, we lit. Can't wait to meet my baby for sure. I love you. So as you can see, Jello really do like her and Nikki, she likes Jello as well. So they're feeding off of each other energy and it seems like everything is going real well for them. And I hope it stays like that. Definitely once the child comes. And to remind y'all, someone else made a post about Nikki dating Jello at her age and she responded by leaving a comment and saying, I'm actually 32, but ain't nothing but a number. We're in love and so thankful for our new bundle of joy. Thanks for the repost. So you could tell that she actually was feeling some type of way about that because people are coming at her about her age. They're literally eight years apart, but you already know how this go. You know what I mean? They're both celebrities. They got money. LeVar always mentors and just help his middle son, Leangelo, to make sure he gets to him where he needs to be. Just because we all know ever since Jello got in trouble in college, it's just been so different. LeVar always been focused on Jello because his path always been harder, definitely throughout his brothers. So of course, that's why his pops is always making sure he's on track with everything. So it's literally only so much LeVar could do. And it's just so funny because I was reading some comments and people were saying that LeVar is pissed about Nikki getting pregnant by Jello due to Jello choosing certain type of females and everything. And I know a lot of y'all seen my previous videos I made when LeVar actually sent a message to his youngest son, LaMelo, about certain females before he even got drafted. And as you can see, look who LaMelo is talking to. And you know Melo is next because literally Lonzo and Jello both have kids now. Melo's the only one. So of course he's the next target. And it's just so hilarious because everything that LeVar said in that video, it all literally came true with his sons dealing with certain type of women. Even before I started recording this video, I decided to type Nikki's name on YouTube and of course a TMZ video popped up that's titled Nikki Baby Causes 30k Worth of Damage to Molly Ma's Home After Breakup. Like what? Oh my god. Yo, I just hope that don't happen to Jello, bro. If she's that tight to destroy stuff, definitely after a breakup, you're in trouble, Jello. You're in big, big, big trouble, dog. I hope you know that because you already had a little taste of Ebony when y'all was going through y'all breakup phase. So just imagine Nikki and you have a child with her on top of that. Yeah, Jello, you better be careful because you know things can get real hectic with these females. So be smart and move wisely. I definitely want y'all to leave y'all comments and opinions below on how y'all feel about this. I thank you guys for watching. Please make sure you like, subscribe. Make sure you press the notification bell. T-Game Week out.